All right, well, what better way to gear up for some fun holiday cheer than with some laughs? Uh -huh. It's time for this week's Kickstand Picks. Portland's comedy scene will surely get you in the pre-Thanksgiving mood. we got to welcome back our friend Dylan Reef, Artistic Director at Kickstand Comedy. Good morning. Good morning. If you just need to blow off a little steam, the holidays are getting <laughs> stressful. we got some shows where you can go laugh a little. Absolutely. Uh, big question. This is one that comes up all the time. So... The movie Die Hard. Oh, no, don't start this mm. Oh, I love this. No, I love don't this. Start okay. This debate. I, I have an opinion. I have it's opinions. worse than anything your uncle's going to ask at Thanksgiving. This is true. Is Die Hard a Christmas movie? <laughs> yes, absolutely, okay. unequivocally. All right. Uh, yep. I'm, I'm still on the fence about it. So, I, the reason I say that before I, we dive totally down the rabbit yes. hole is tell me another time of year you watch Die Hard. This is true. Boom. I know, that's I all know. you need. I that's all you need. I, I if you watch a monthly, then for you, it's not a Christmas year. movie. <laughs> I know. Well, it can be It can be a holiday tradition in your house uh, with a fun Portland spin. Yes. The reason I bring it up is I'm going to tell you that Die Hard is now a musical. <laughs> oh. We have a Die Hard musical parody. This is the flagship musical parody at the Fun House Lounge. It is just a blast. It starts <laughs> now. It's going to run all the way through the holidays because you got to, you know, the, the day after Thanksgiving is usually when you put up the Christmas lights. How about you just start November with a, a, a holiday musical? But I love it. Die Hard is, it's so much fun. There's 13 original parody songs that they created wow. for it. Uh, and it's a killer cast. It's just so much fun. And you're going to see all the special effects. Uh, in big air quotes, done live on stage. Uh -huh. So you don't want to miss it. It's at the Fun House Lounge, and it kicks off starting this Thursday. This was one of those shows that kind of put Fun House on the, on the map. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. It, it really, you know, they do genre comedy so well, and you're just going to have a blast, whether you know the movie really well or it's your first time seeing it through the lens of a musical parody, you're uh -huh. going to have a blast. And then go watch the movie. Yeah, Parrot, say, it's a give, nice give double it a, feature. Give it a rewatch. Yeah, no, that'd be fun to compare the two. That's, that's super fun fun. Mm -hmm. What else is coming up this weekend? Uh, after that, uh, you know, I heard you all talk to Nikki Glaser this week. Yes, love her. And uh, she has a big show coming up. It's probably pretty sold out at this point. There is another show happening on Saturday at Kickstand Comedy. It's a sneak peek. You're going to get a sneak peek at our new venue space uh, so you can see what, what's been going on there. We have some new uh, paint. We have a brand new uh, venue that's opening up and two of the hottest improv teams in town. And I'm a little bit biased. I'm on one of them. So uh, <laughs> you can come check it out. Uh, but we're going to see Four Ginger and Breaking News, two amazing comedy troops, and you're going to see the brand new venue. So come out to Sneak Peek on Saturday at 7 p.m. Awesome. All right. Okay. And then on Sunday, a super fun queer variety show. It's going to be a blast. It's called Defiant Joy, and I love the folks who are putting it on. It's at Al's Den. Uh, Dahlia Bell is going to be hosting it. They have a really amazing group of queer LGBTQIA plus uh, comedians and artists doing a variety of things. We're going to see stand-up, there's drag, there's sketch. So it's just a nice celebration in a really wonderful venue. So uh, definitely on Sunday, it's a can't miss. Yeah, awesome. we, we've talked about it before. Al's Den is a really, really it's solid a venue. venue. It's a fun it spot is. to go. Yeah. And what else is on Sunday? And then let's Let's keep it going. Uh, more uh, queer comedy. Uh, it's Josh Thomas. Josh is so, so, so funny. I don't know if you've seen either one of his hit shows, but he was a teenage, like, breakout comedian star in Australia, and he ended up having two really, really wonderful, kind of super funny, heartwarming shows that were released, I think, originally through the BBC. Huh. But you can watch cool. those streaming. Catch up on Josh Thomas, because he is a very unique talent, and for, for my money, Sunday, it's going to be a blast to go see him at the Aladdin Theater where there's not a bad seat in the house. Mm. But if you're looking for a new comedy crush, Josh Thomas is, is the place to go this Sunday. Oh, he's fun. Just, he's just so endearing and charismatic, and his perspective on life and dating and uh, just growing up in Australia is really fun. Yeah. Oh, cool. I, I, think the, I think the UK and Australia has some of the best, like their takes on comedy. It's yeah. just, I don't know, it's a brand of comedy that I really enjoy. Absolutely. So yeah. it's, it's a really fun weekend through and through and yeah. you, you can't miss with any of those shows that's All awesome and you got to rewatch die hard yep i'll just add that one to the put list put it on the <laughs> list rewatch <laughs> die hard is planned mm -hmm. All Dylan, right. thanks so awesome. much awesome thanks for having me always good to have you here and if you want to learn more about kickstand all the fun work happening at their nonprofit, stay in the loop on local comedy shows you can do all that and more at kickstandcomedy.org